Um, well, my name's Avery Bratt. I'm a clinical psychologist, um, and I work in Prairie Village, Kansas. Work with my wife, and we have two other people in the office, um, primarily doing neurofeedback. I, I got into neurofeedback kind of as a skeptic, and I've always had a background in neurology. Um, but um, since doing neurofeedback now, I've really never seen anything as effective um, for such a variety of issues. This neurofeedback community, this affiliate, is, um, is just such a positive thing. And in many medical fields, um, there's a lot of competition going on. And neurofeedback, I think, is a very different is, is has a very different perspective, and this affiliate affiliate community especially has a different um, attitude because everyone is so there's such a collegial and accepting atmosphere. Um, you have a question, and you can ask you know present it to the group or to any individual, and they're happy to share that information. After I first trained, I had a real hard time conceptualizing how I could ever um, add neurofeedback to, to my practice because it was a pretty traditional clinical practice. Um, so when I brought the equipment, when I bought the equipment, I used it at home for about six months and then I took it to my office and I just offered clients that I'd already had, I was already seeing, um, the services. You know, basically, if you I let them know, I'm just learning this. If you want to, if you want to do it, uh, we can do that, and I won't charge you anything. So it was just a compliment to the services in a way for me to get practice. And it was amazing the results we were getting. And this was you know, I was just starting, and so after several months, a lot of the clients that I was offering this service to would come in for their session. Say, well, why don't we just do that neurofeedback stuff? instead of talking today and you know and then people were just it was just word of mouth people calling to come in for neurofeedback and today 90% um, of the people I see I do neurofeedback with uh, I think absolutely that it's, it's um, that they should add it to their practice um, the results are, that you can get are just amazing, but um, a caveat is there is that after going to a, a four-day training, um, they need to have a mentor and learn how to do this well. Um, and, and I can't stress that enough, um, as this can help a lot of people. It, you know, we have to take the responsibility for doing it right. first learned it, I, did, I had a hard time visualizing how I could ever incorporate this into a private practice. Today, I could not imagine doing a practice without neurofeedback. Um, I've never, truly never seen anything with um, such potential um, or such benefit for such a wide variety of things. and. Um, so I, I can't imagine having a practice without neurofeedback today.